Unfortunately, it's not that uncommon that somebody comes in with a surprise pregnancy and they're on some sort of birth control. That could be birth control pills, it could be the Depo shot, uh, the progesterone injection, it could be they have an IUD in or some other birth control and yet they get pregnant anyways. And it's always scary for people because they've been taking these hormones, for instance, if they're on pills, and now they're pregnant and they didn't know it for some amount of time, and so they know the baby's been exposed to these hormones. Well, the good news is there's a lot of data that women that get pregnant with birth control pills, for instance, um, really don't have an increased risk of birth defects in the baby. So it's very, very unlikely that birth control pills are gonna cause problems in the pregnancy. So if you do get pregnant and you're on the birth control pill, Stop taking your birth control pill because obviously you don't need it, um, but you don't need to worry that you've caused some horrible damage to your baby because that really is not an issue uh, when you get pregnant on hormonal contraceptives. So that's good news for you. Now, the other one that's concerning is when people get pregnant with an IUD in place. Now, an IUD is a little T-shaped device uh, that goes in the uterus that keeps you from getting pregnant, but it's not 100%, and sometimes people do get pregnant with the IUD in. Now, many times when people come in with a positive pregnancy test and they've got an IUD in, it turns out the IUD actually isn't in at all, but at some point fell out, and that's why they're pregnant. And in that case, there's no risk whatsoever. However, it's not uncommon to see somebody with a positive pregnancy test and the IUD is still appropriately in, in the appropriate place. If somebody's early in pregnancy in the first trimester, it's considered uh, best practice to remove that IUD. It, there is a small risk that it'll cause a miscarriage, however, the risk of leaving the IUD in place um, for later in pregnancy is much higher than the risk of miscarriage. And so if you're in the first trimester with an IUD in, I recommend removal of the IUD. If, however, you present and the baby's much bigger and the IUD's in, then the risk of removing it become much greater and it probably uh, is not a good idea. And that's something that you're going to want to talk to your doctor about. The other thing that occasionally happens is somebody comes in and they think they have an IUD and they're pregnant. And I do an exam and I don't see any evidence of the IUD when I look through the vagina. Now, there's the strings of the IUD aren't where they're supposed to be. In that case, we do an ultrasound and sometimes we do see the IUD in the uterus. However, there isn't an easy way to get to it. And so the only way to get to that IUD is to really do an exploration of the uterus with an instrument and that can be very risky for the baby. And so in those situations, we generally leave the IUD in place and follow the pregnancy carefully with ultrasounds. So if you get pregnant with an IUD, generally you want to get to the doctor as soon as possible so that IUD can be removed. If the IUD is not able to be removed, for the most part, those babies do well, but there is some risk that the IUD can cause some problems later in pregnancy. So something that's going to be one to watch closely. If you get pregnant, however, on hormonal contraceptive, you really have nothing to worry about. Just stop the contraception uh, and don't worry at all. Your baby's going to be fine. Twice.com